Oh yes, this was the George Foreman Isle. They should rename it to the George Foreman Isle. Hello, it's Jeffrey with Real Nifty Vintage, and today Barb and I are here at Goodwill. Will it be good? I don't know. So this thrift store is in... Glen Carbon. Glen, Car Glen Carbon? Technically it might be. Or Edwardsville. Edwardsville. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to go into this Goodwill. I have not been in so long to this particular location, but it's in a nicer area, so maybe they have nicer vintage things. They have old nice things. I don't know. But let's go inside and see what we can find. All right, here it is. The Goodwill Retail Store and Donation Center. And we're going to go inside and maybe we'll just find some things. All right, here's a mug with scotch tape on it. I don't know. So there's some hummingbird musical things, some Christmas, Christmas time. I don't see a lot of vintage Christmas over here. I'm anxious to go to the figurines though. That's one of my favorite spots, this area back here. So let's see what we can find. There's some witches. There's three witch sisters. The Sanderson sisters, you know, from Hocus Pocus. Little poodle with the duck, or that's a lamb. It's a lamb with the duck. A lady with no face. Okay, that's a fun lady with no face. Little teapot. And then what is this here? Hmm. It's kind of pretty. They've got lots of bells. Oh! A dollar. Key Largo. There's just a little chip right there, but. What is the other one that you have? Is it a different? Florida, Florida? probably. You could have like a collection of those uh, different cities. I don't want to, oh. but somebody else could. <laughs> there are a lot of bells. Somebody must have had a bell collection of their own, honestly. Hmm. There's a pig. Well, I don't know. I don't really see a whole lot over here. Oh, except this dog and a... I thought that was a cat, but it's a dog and a dog. The ear is broken off, though. Neko. All right. Let's see. Which way? There's the toy aisle there. And the lamps. I guess we go this way. The arrow says that we can. I don't usually find many toy items. Our, the kids love that. We had that what is it? one. It's a oh, roadie. roadie. And it's like a bouncing thing. Just okay. We bounce all over the house. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> yeah, these aren't really that old, these toys. No, most are not. I came over here because I could see the top of this, and I thought it looked like something exciting, but it oh. wasn't as much as I thought. So. No, it's a crafted piece. The wood. I, oh, look at all of that going on. There's like, well. Look at all the burger machines. You can have a different color for every day. I know. We can open up a burger shop. <laughs> you and I, we each have our own little George Foreman grill. Barb's Burgers. Barb's Burgers. With Jeffrey. <laughs> With special guest. Gordon? No, no, Jordan. Jordan. What was I thinking? I'm Gordon. <laughs> All right. Well, the wood stuff is letting me down. I I just don't I don't think that that's we're just not gonna find the wood stuff today. Oh, I like this stand. I'm gonna get this for the shop for the sale. For oh, for it's nine dollars. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> just kidding. Thanks, but no thanks. Um, it's nine dollars. Do you think I would sell it for more? Did you know how much it was? Don't you think it has like a boho vibe or it something? It is bo. It is really boho. Ho ho ho. <laughs> Bohemian. I just. So I would think that that is a thirty-dollar plant stand. Okay. And do I care to make twenty dollars and deal with its size? 
Right. Impossible, not failing. Right. Failing. That's true. That's what I think. That's what goes through my head. Okay. Where we are now, if we were in maybe California or somewhere else, it yeah. could go for maybe more. Maybe 50, 60. Yeah, that's true. But I'm not shipping it either. So mm -hmm. that's a problem. I just yeah. noticed this bowl over oh, here. Someone's gotten through with all their bakeware. I'm going to get this one. Six dollars. Is it impulse? Oh, look. Tigger. It has some texture to it. Oh, wow. It's blown. It's beautiful. You're blown and beautiful, darling. And when I did graduation cakes, I had that too in the garage. Oh my gosh, cake. they're having a... And this one. They're having, yeah, a grand old, they're having a grand old time over there on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> um, I saw anyway. that. I thought it was pretty. Yeah, for six. I will do I it. I just wasn't sure about six, but it's not bad. It's blown. Yeah. I think it's a smart idea. Red is the sale color. What? Oh, 50% off red tags. Well, I don't think either one of my things are red. Never <laughs> usually are. <laughs> um, the fabric, do you want to look at? Or, like, okay, so the mugs and stuff, did you see any? Eh. Well, I mean, I didn't look behind mm. them, but... I'm not into most of these things. Hmm. Ramekins? Lighthouses? They are Corral, I believe. Aren't they? Maybe I'm dumb. Oops. Yeah, I don't know. I thought they were. Uh, maybe they're not. Okay. So we will look at the fabrics. Yes. Right over here. Infant bedding. They have a whole section. Um. They're pretty sparse. Are these? What are these? What are you? Is it? They're not apron. Oh, they go on like maybe a window, a val like a valance. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this afghan's kind of pretty. How do we like that? I wish the brown wasn't on there. Yeah. How much? Think of it this Five dollars. Brown is like the ice cream cone, and then the other colors. Are You're like right. <laughs> How'd that just end up in the basket? <laughs> That was silly. It just was right there. <laughs> and then it happened. But I'm glad it happened. We did a good job. Okay, well, I bought a napkin. Now, we can also look at the artwork, but I'm trying not to, personally. Look at that big amber glass thing. Yeah. I'm not sure how old it is, but let's take a look at it real closely. Oh, it has controlled bubbles on the inside of it. Oh, that's heavy. You're a heavy whore. Or... <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> Six dollars. Made in China. It's a $6 made in China. That's really nice. All right. I don't mind that hummingbird. It's a musical hummingbird. This one has words. Life's little pleasures are the sweetest. Nineteen ninety is that one. Well, this one doesn't have words, so maybe that. Maybe I'll get it. <laughs> Six dollars. Oh, it's red. Oh, it's red. Oh my I got, gosh! I got a deal. <laughs> I got a deal. I'm getting the three dollar thing. Where do you go? Where do you go, little bird? Right here. Put it up here. Oh yeah. Yeah, I don't want to fall out the hole. Nine of them. In there we go. Oh. Oh. It's a red tag, so it's Here's one of these dollars. little things. Oh, a creamer for the cottage. It's supposed to be six cookies. The cottage. cottage. What is those words I'm looking for? And a 15-inch cookie. Mm. Mm. The, um, the, it's a, um... Like the biscuits jars like that? Uh, yes. No, yes, and yes. <laughs> no, yes, and yes. I... A tea, they're like a tea set. It's a teapot with the sugar and the creamer, and they're usually made in England. It's like a thatched house cottage. Yeah, it, yeah. Yeah. It looks like this, but 
Oh. All right. Um, let's go this other way. I don't think we, I think we skipped. Oh, we have the lamp aisle to go through. The lamp aisle. It's this way. We're just going to go together. Because Barb is, I don't know what she's doing. Oh, yes, this was the George Foreman aisle. They should rename it to the George Foreman aisle. Um, lamp shades, boom boxes, boom box, boom, boom box. I'm having fun saying boom box. <laughs> All right, I just looked up those Wilton cake pans because sometimes they do well. Uh, Tigger, he's not doing very well. Neither is Barbie. Barbie's not having a good day either, so I don't know. I'm not going to get the, the cake pans. I mean, sometimes they're, they're good, but they're also just large and annoying. Am I right or am I right? Sugar and tea. Very, very worn. Very. Oh, some cones. Do I need cones for anything? No, I don't think I do. Hmm. This is plastic wear, by the way. All of it. Oh, I used to buy these all the time. These Tupperware Jello molds. They come apart in three ways, or in three places. And I would sell them. There's that one, and there's one over there. I think they also had them in blue, like this blue color. Okay, well, I'm really, I don't know, I'm not seeing much down this plasticware aisle. Tumblers. There's a, there's a Tupperware. That might be from the Wonderlier bowl set. Hmm, I don't know. Why is it the middle like that? It's all, it's all stuck out. Does that mean it's not good? I don't know. All right, well, this was not very much going on in this aisle. Well, I found a fairy lamp. Well, part of one right here. Unfortunately, it is sprayed on red flaking Ugh. it's the top of one and it would be like an amber base you can kind of see that uh, duck look i found you a basket for a dollar are you <laughs> put that back <laughs> this one's really cute that's though. ugly too oh. it looks like somebody's lips <laughs> i don't know why that was a thing but it <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah, I did. Could this be a cart? People just put their stuff in that thing. I don't know. I think I have enough baskets for the pop up, pop up, for the pop up shell. Okay. For the pop up shell. And we looked at the fabrics. We could look at the jewelry, but it's not usually very well here. They have two cases up here, but they're. It's remarkable to see what the stuff they put in here and for how much. Look at that beer thing. Is that a beer thing? Beer. For thirty dollars, right yeah. there. Huh. It's this thing. Glass yard of ale. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And there's purses and all sorts. There's this case here too. A VR one for fifteen dollars. That's a nice picture. Golden teapot for fifteen dollars. A knife block set for $15. What? USN stamped heavy duty trays, $50. For three of those. Some crystal for 12 and 30. Okay. And then a crystal like. <laughs> it's a crystal like. They're just like, it's like crystal for 12 for that angel. <laughs> Barb, here's what we need for the pop-up sale. A chocolate oh my fountain. Gosh, I love those. They're so unsanitary, but Yeah. Oh, I love it. <laughs> yeah. Well. <gasps> Are you kidding me? 
$45 for the crystal-like bowl. Well, it actually might be crystal, but oh my goodness. Well, overall, that was pretty good. Um, now, Barbara, <laughs> I got myself a little weight. You got a weight. It's and not even for me, but. <laughs> that's sad, because you could have really built your upper body strength. <laughs> It's a two pound weight. And would you like to mention the story? Oh, it's for my son. He hurt his arm pitching, so he's got to do physical therapy. So then he needs a weight. Yep. They mentioned a two pound weight. So he's getting a pink one. Yeah. Used. <laughs> a used pink weight. Boy. Exciting. He has a rough life. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, so I think we did all right. I got a few things myself. The Afghan, you know, in, in, the, in, in the moment, I was thinking the brown was kind of ugly with it but I kind of like the brown now I'm kind of living for it it reminds I, me like of an ice cream cone yeah the brown and the colors the cone or even just the chocolate part of a Neapolitan yeah mm hmm I think it's good it's a caramely color is there caramel ice cream there must be of course <laughs> well I mean it's usually like white with caramel mixed in is there like ever one that's like just like Mm, well, I don't know. Yeah. There's like Rocky Road that could be brown, too. Mm, There's yeah. lots of brown ice creams out there. Yeah. It's a thing. S'mores. You know, overall, we did great. It's really a pretty day. I mean, mm. all in all, I think things are going well here in Edwardsville. So thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.